Hello everybody, Aquagear here, and welcome back to another episode of Redstone Mini. Today, we are going to be looking at another secret redstone door. So this door is going to more focus on a little bit of camouflage and natural look, instead of actual technical redstone. Uh, so I put a little skit together just to kind of show you guys how someone would find it, even though they probably wouldn't. So I hope you guys enjoy, and I'll be back after to show you guys how to build it. Alright everybody, so this is episode 7398, and today we are going to be getting our first dirt block. Can you believe it? We've made it so far. In almost 7,000 episodes, we have gotten a dirt block. So, uh, real quick, let's go chop down a tree. What? Oh, that looks natural, but wait. Oh, it's actually a secret hidden door. Wow. Ouch. <laughs> Welcome back, everybody. So, this is actually the redstone door that I used in that skit. And guys, by the way, I know that was horrible acting in the skit. I just play video games. I'm not an actor. I'm not in Hollywood. I'm sorry about that. So, if the skit really was horrible, I'm sorry about that. But, let's actually get to the important part and look at the door. This door is very small. Like I said, it uses mostly camouflage to actually be a, a secret redstone door. Not a lot of redstone. All you need is four sticky pistons, four blocks for the actual door, two buttons, one torch, and five pieces of redstone. As you can see, if we press the button, that torch goes off, and that makes this redstone go off also. And, and that means we can go through the door. So the timing is kind of bad, because you can't really change the timing on the door, but if you just want a small secret base, this is very useful for it. Uh, so over here, I just have like another kind of example as where you could hide it. So let's say you're on the side of a mountain, just kind of like the skit. You can maybe hide hide a stone door behind it and it could just be a secret door so one more uh, one more time this could be used in many different ways though the only problem with it is you do need to kind of put it on an elevated surface like a mountain you can't put it on flat ground but for what it is I really really like it well everybody I hope you enjoyed I know today's episode was kind of really short and I didn't really do a tutorial I just kind of wanted to show off the door I mean it's it's really really small you guys could probably look at it and build it and probably memorize it by heart because it's really really not that hard but otherwise I hope you learned something and this has been Aqua Gear make sure to leave a like and a comment as it supports my channel and I'll see you guys later God bless and goodbye